as usual, Crashville, Tennessee never disappoints. If you, if you just don't drive through here overnight, you just can't get through here without getting into some kind of mess like this. It never fails. Never, never. See if I can't figure out how to get this darn Walmart. Roxy doesn't have much dog food left. She's got beef flavor, and she does not like beef flavor. She's a she likes that chicken. We're gonna do what we can. Looks like it's got a full house. We just have to get one spot. Houston, Texas, and once again, same thing. Turn the key, nothing. Nothing. So we're doing this again. I don't know how expensive this is gonna be to try and get it started. They said it starts at 170, start, so. I don't know where we're going to finish, but uh, get um, the top engine lights on. And usually every time that's happened, I've had to get towed. So we'll see how it goes. Arrived at destination. Well, I'm turning in here. I don't know if it's going to be right or wrong. Crown beverage packaging. Uh-oh. Y'all have drank a few of these. I don't know where the flatbeds go, but I'm sure they'll tell me. Tell me how to get there, too. There's a little staging area. Ooh, these people are busy. I'm just going to pull right here out of the way so all of these people can get around me. Curve in, come on, so I don't get blocked in. Find out where flatbed goes. That was easy enough. One of their drivers just pulled up and he said, Go down to the fence, hang a right, and go down to the far corner. I guess I'll stop at this stop sign and I'll walk. See where they want me. That's what I'm going to do. back up right there and I'm tart. That's what I'm guessing. Yeah, I'm flip around. That's what it looks like I'm going to do. Just back up right there and we'll see. And it's just like we left with it. Perfect, perfect. So, boy, they got them in here. I wonder how many cans they can make out of one coil on my ass. Time to get to work.
looking like a wreck already. We're gonna go to the Loves, but this guy said they make 36 to 38 million cans a day. Miss Roxy, she uh, she don't like this truck. She's like, get me home, get me home. So this load should be taking us home. And here we go. My fleet manager sent a message out, lay off the phones, I've been in a meet. So, probably take them a little bit to get me dispatched. Cause I'm the black sheep. And this load's taking me home. I'm at the Flying J in Houston and this guy right here, he just wanted to come shine my wheels with a spray bottle and a roll of toilet paper. Uh, that's a first for me. I don't know. Maybe toilet paper shines more than your butthole good. <laughs> Woo! Get on out of here. We are finally getting to roll out of this Flying J. We're picking up. I forget where we're picking up. We're going somewhere in Louisiana and delivering tomorrow. That's a real good shot of the city and the bridge over there. They can keep it though. Man, the traffic's just too darn rough around here. We've been flowing smoothly so far. Hope it stays that way. This is so far about the easiest I've ever cruised through Dallas. Almost unbelievable. I'll take it though. I bet the law enforcement would too. Oh, well, that sign right there is messed up. Exit left to US 75. Well, we did not make it all the way through. I knew it was bound to happen. Just it says shipping over there. I seen one more empty trailer out there, so. see what we get. I'm back over here where I came the first time just with, not without a trailer. Oh gosh I'm getting a step deck. I guess that's mine right there. That's mine, that's mine, that's mine. I guess I'll just pull straight in here and try and back up to it. This is backwards for me but I'm a little crooked once I put my tarps up there I'll straighten that out this is it five three five five hundred who a free bungee look at that I'm just raking it in today raking it in what my tires look like well they're round I can make do with that I got mud blasts. Is that a dent right there? Ooh, yeah, a little one. That's all good. Somebody backed that up in the mud. Look at all that mud right there. That mud flaps tore up. Oh, never fails. It's cosmetic, so that rail's damaged. Alrighty, easy enough. I'm not gonna film strapping this because I gotta get my ass going. I'm running behind, and there's really no show on a load like this. That's just gonna be five straps three straps one belly strap and then a couple over the front so this is what i ended up with i threw a couple belly straps there they don't want you climbing on it here so not a lot you can do that uh cut the side wall they wanted it changed so he's here changing it 
It looked cosmetic to me, but they want it changed. They can do what they want to with it. I just drive the truck. Darn, it's got that twisted right there. I'm glad I didn't tighten it down yet. Get that took care of. And then we're gonna try and make it to Shreveport to the Petro. I reserved the spot because I'm gonna lose my shower credits anyways. They're all gonna expire while I'm on home time. But it is hot out here. I'm whooped. Bye.